Just got back from the first training session of 2017. It was a good one. It was a great one. I smashed it because I'm motivated. I'm obsessed. Because I heard that this, this match on January 3rd with Randall wasn't just made by IWA management. No, no, no. No, that one, Randall asked for. Randall asked for Tyson Gibbs. We've never faced each other. And there's a reason for that. And that's because I'm on a different level to you, kid. That's because you're somewhere around the middle. And I'm in the stratosphere. Because I'm a bloody star. People are telling you that you're on a roll. And I think that's why you've got such a big set of balls on you right now. Is because you think you're on a roll. And, and, and let's, let's have a, a quick look. Like, who have you actually beaten? Who have you actually beaten? You beat the Milky Bar Kid. You beat you beat Kevin Beetle. You beat uh, you beat Fat Boy Gat. And and you couldn't you couldn't beat Paris. So someone needs to explain to me how that's a role. And someone needs to explain to you that it's not. So if you want to ask for this match and you want to try and make a name for yourself off of my ma- my name, you better be ready for a beating, mate. Not 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 just to be beaten. No, I'm gonna smash your face in. And I'm going to make you quit. That's a promise. (sighs) January 3rd. Make sure you strap on your little mask extra tight. Because you're going to need it to hold your head together, mate. Get your dust off your nicest little plastic shorts. Because it's the last time people are going to see Randall in an IWA ring. You're going to quit. You're going to quit on the night. And you're going to quit wrestling in general. Because you can't hang with Tyson Gibbs. No way. So, uh, my advice is to uh, enjoy the next couple of days. Go get yourself a nice big box of Krispy Kreme donuts and get comfortable somewhere. Pop on WWE Network and eat them all. Because that is the last good memory you're going to have, my friend because you're gonna live in pain forever.